Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. Out at the range today with heavy metal, and because of so many of you guys asked for it, I've gone and bought some of this normal whitetail in 308 Winchester. This is 150 grainers. If you haven't seen them yet, I have filmed every other cartridge in normal whitetail. So 270, 243, 6. 0.5 Creedmoor, 30 out 6. I've already filmed every single one that they're loading except for the 308 and the 7 millimeter Magnum, which we're going to do that next. So stay tuned for the 7 millimeter mag if you're a fan of those. But um, a bunch of this stuff I'm seeing come on the shelves locally, and a bunch of this normal whitetail stuff I actually got from Ammo Shop Online. So if you can't find anything, check out Ammo Shop Online. I think I've told you guys before that's where I'm finding some of this ammo. But today, for this video, I've brought out my Ruger American. On top, I've got a super budget-friendly Bushnell banner. It's got 16 zoomies on it. Uh, but this would be my 308 that I'd take out in the woods, not afraid to scratch it up and ding it up. Absolutely a deer rifle. So that's what I wanted to test out this 308. Uh, normal whitetail. So I'm gonna get right to it. This rifle um, was already sighted in some time ago with some different 150 grainers. I can't remember what we sighted it in with so we should be pretty close to the bullseye at 100 yards uh, but that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go back to 100 yards. Oh depending on what happens um, let's plan on shooting um, two different three shot groups just to see how my Ruger American likes this normal whitetail in 308. But tons of you guys asked for it, so we're going to film it today. Uh, let's get to it. I'm going to get set up with the cameras, go back to 100 yards, and see how this stuff does in my 308. I'm assuming it's going to do great, <laughs> judged off of how well it has worked in all the other calibers I tested. But let's get to it, see what happens. Should be pretty cool. All right, so back here. At 100 yards, I got the lead sled out here. I even remembered the sandbags, so I'm gonna try to take me out of the equation here and do my absolute best to test this ammo. Ooh, this thing's so heavy, I can barely move. Uh, but here's what here's what I'm gonna do. Let me load up three real quick. I'll shoot a three-shot group, and then I'll make an adjustment and try to do a three shot group on the bullseye. That way that this Ruger American is sighted in with this whitetail ammo and we'll be ready for deer season. But let's fling three of these blue lights here first. See where they're at. Oh yeah, so this ammo is, is pretty close to whatever this Ruger's already sighted in at, but two more. Just the other side. We might not need to adjust this one at all for this ammo. Right close to the first one. But do we need to move it? Nah, based on that average there, I'm not even gonna touch the scope. I'm good with that. Look out, white tail deer. But I'm going to load up three more here. And we'll go to a clean plate and see how she runs. Again, go to move this up a bit. All right, let's do another three shot group here. Number two here. The spread on this one's opening up a little bit, maybe because we're heating this baby up. I don't know. Send the third one. Ooh. That's pretty consistent. 
Let's go down there and, and take a closer look, but I think those last two are touching. Maybe that first shot was just uh, just my trigger squeeze, but let's go take a closer look. All right, so going up to our target here, here is our first target. Just for the sake of having a reference, this circle, that's a penny that I traced, which is three quarters of an inch. So I'd say this group is right at an inch grouping there at 100 yards to those almost touching and then our second attempt did not touch the scope we had two almost touching again and that one right there that one's probably just over a one inch group there but there you have it guys the norma whitetail and 308 out of my ruger american this is my workhorse 308 had this thing probably four years and I may have cleaned it once. Probably not even then. But um, Ruger American, they've always done me good. Never had much issues out of them, uh, especially for the price. Hard to beat them. This one, you can see, shooting one inch groups at 100 yards. This normal whitetail stuff. Hey, now that we've tested it, I've got the confidence in it for deer season. So if we want to. Uh, go get a deer with the 308. We'll put that Norma in this Ruger American. Baby's ready to go sight it in for deer season. As always, really appreciate you guys watching. It really means a lot. Don't forget to check out all the links down below. Make sure you're subscribed to our Friends Heavy Metal. Comment down below what you want to see next time. Like I said, I've already tested all of these Norma Whitetails now with the exception of 7mm Rem Mag. So stay tuned for the Rem Mag video. Appreciate y'all. We'll see you on the next one. Hootie hoo! Yeah.